All right, welcome back to Mass Effect. Now, I decided to just make the last video the end of the last video because it was about it was over half an hour long. So this is the next video. Let's land. And it works this time. Ayara and Rex, come along. Oh, Ashley's dead. Spoiler alert in case you haven't seen the previous video, but if you're jumping into the middle of a Mass Effect series, I'm going to bet that you know what's happening in Mass Effect. In fact, no, from here on out, I will have a complete, perfect, guaranteed spoiler alert system. Absolutely no spoilers unless warning is made beforehand. Because I hate it when people spoil things for other people without warning. Now, I do think for that one spoiler there, this is the Mass Effect. Anyone watching this is probably going to know that things can happen. Things like that can happen. So I, I, I'll consider that adequate warning once. But from now on, any kind of spoiler, spoiler warning. Ever. All the time. Guaranteed from me. Always a spoiler warning. <laughs> now. Now, 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 now. There's a listening pause or something here, it's at. Uh, son of a... Yeah, a listening post. What the hell is this thing? I've never been on this planet before, and this is just a, this is just a random one that I picked. Because I have picked up a few bits of information, and that there's one landable... Usually one landable planet or thing in... Oh, there's a thing here. Per galaxy, not galaxy, that would be rubbish. Per star system. What the hell? What the sod was that? Okay, whatever this is, let's get it. What the hell is that? Okay, so we've got more Meteorox writings. There must be more than the amount that you need to collect. But something was updated on the map. What the hell is that? I don't like that, whatever it is. It sounds familiar, though. Thresher more. Wait, this is... Rachni! Why are there Rachni here? Okay, I need to switch to Shredder rounds for these. I'm actually using Shredder rounds. Okay, beautiful. That means everyone else should be as well. Yeah, everyone is using appropriate ammo. Good. Why are there Rachni here? No, seriously, why are there Rachni here? Alright, let's get Re Let's spend Rex's points. We want to get him powered up. Okay, Max Krogan Battlemaster. That's a given. Uh, Stasis, not going to be using that. Barry, you're not going to be using that. I could get him to master throw, or I could increase his fitness. Now, for throw, we do have Liara. Although having two biotics could be good. I'm going to get him to master throw. And from there, we're going to fitness. And he's got immunity, which is good. I doubt I'll be using that manually, but it's possible. Right, now, let's drive the Mako closer. It'll be a lot quicker. Um, okay, so we know there are Rachni on this planet now. I don't know why, but I know this is a bad thing, and they look like those rocks around those monkey colonies. Whatever they are. Oh, holy hell, nuts! Thumbs! I just find all my powers off in a frenzy. All right, come on.
Ah, okay, so they'll come out of each of these things. Well, that's what it seems like. I will check them all out. So are they Rachni things as well, perhaps? This is unnerving, this. It looks like they've just sprouted up out of nowhere, because they wouldn't have built this thing here with these right next to it, would they? Or maybe they put them there, or... I really don't know. Either way, we leveled up. Let's spend points. Ooh, I'm level 50. Nice. Um, damp, yes, damping. That's what I wanted to go and do. Good. And Liara, more intellectronics for you. Ah, advanced overload. Nice. And Rex, let's make you more fit. Go to the gym, please. All right, let's be getting inside. I really have no idea what to expect in here, and that is the complete... Oh, Liara, you're dying. I will heal you up. Oh dear. Looks rather a lion, see, I think. Looks rather dead, too. Ooh, hard decryption. Holy crap. We're getting the good stuff now. This is like Frogger, I just realized. <laughs> And more good. Oh, that's rubbish. <laughs> All right, well, let's get going. Oh, crud. I bet it's Rachni as well. Finally, some action. Oh, it's those little things. Oh, no, those things are bad if they get close, I recall. Why are they racking out here? Did, they, did the queen lie to us? Is this her? Is this her doing? I, I really don't know. I hope the queen didn't lie to us. I really hope she's... Oh. No, please don't have do this, done this, Ragnai queen. I'm going to bet it's something completely innocent. I hope, anyway. Go through this way first. What the hell? Okay, I don't want to shoot them just in case there's something good or something. Ah, biotic amps. We need one of those for Rex. I'll check Liara's out as well. No, that's far worse. Now these will both be better than what he's currently got. And that... That's actually exactly the same, but it's a way higher model. And a slightly increased cooldown. Holy crap. Uh, yeah, Polaris 8 for Rex. The hell is this place? What's going on here? So I really hope it's not the Queen. Alright. Russian sounding weapons always seem to be the best in this game. Don't know why. Alright, let's get down here. There's something in this other room, and I want to find out what it is. Run. A terminal, so we're going to find out what's happened here, hopefully. Kinetic coil, not useful to me, but thank you anyway. Emergency FTL com. Gonna do a save here. Mayday! 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 This is Lieutenant Marie Durand, 314th Infantry, Alliance 10th Frontier Division. The listening post has been overrun by unidentified hostile life forms. Request immediate extraction. Oh dear. Well, you didn't get extraction, I don't think. Shepard, their logs say they received a supply run two days ago. The Rachni worked fast. This is suspicious. Tell me about that supply ship. This planet is supposed to be uninhabited. The Rachni didn't come from nowhere. I will need a moment. This base is supplied by drone freighters, dispatched at irregular intervals from different depots, to reduce the likelihood of tracking. I have it. This one came from Argos Row. What? Wherever it is, there's probably more Rachni there. Let's get to the bottom of this. Right. Agreed. 
The Rakhine infestation, infestation on Alt Altai seems to be the result of a supply drop from Argos Row. The logs downloaded from the freighter should allow you to backtrack the ship, backtrack the ship's course to its origin. Oh, holy crap. Oh, holy crap. This is getting deeper than I thought it would. Well, this means we've got to go there and sort this problem out. Because someone did this on purpose. And I'm thinking it's not the Queen, because the Queen wouldn't ship things in on friggin' supplies runs, would she? It doesn't seem like a very Rachni Queen-y thing to do to me. It seems like more a... Uh, whatever the company was who were experimenting on them thing to do. It really does seem like that kind of thing, so I'm suspecting it's them. I really ho Mass Effect, don't do this now. Be right back, and this will be part of the next part of the next video. It'll join them together. Be right back. Alright, we're back outside the listening post, and now we're going to Argos Roar. Yes, return to the Normandy. To figure out where these Rachni came from. I really had no idea this mission was a thing, so let's see if we can get to the bottom of this. Right, where's the Argos Row cluster? There it is! That was a, that was good luck. I don't know which system it's gonna be in. I've gotta check my journal. And the journal says... Huh? It's a different place now. What? Okay, Sticks Theta Cluster then. That's... What? It did say Argos Road, didn't it? Because I skipped through the text and the... Dialogue a bit when when it came out. But hang on, that's Sticks Theatre we're in now. What the hell? The Erebus system in the Sticks Theatre cluster. Okay, I think that's a different system then. Yeah, this is Asheron. And Erebus is there. Oh, okay. So it's randomized. That's actually really interesting. I didn't know that was a thing. Alright, I don't remember what the planet was, so I'm going to scan them all. This will be the planet. <laughs> I am still going to scan them all, of course. Because everything must be scanned. We might find a Prothean data disk here. Which would be lovely. Oh, Platinum, that's not what I wanted. I want a Prothean data disk. Where money? Oh, yes! Oh, yes! Yes! How lucky was that? Oh, yes! Oh, hell yes! We've got the last data disk! We've done them all! Apart from the minerals, which I don't really care to finish. I mean, they give you money, but I've, I've maxed out on money, so... I don't know. Okay, the Aron Rex, come along. Okay, ooh, I like the sky. It's rather pretty. And we land. All right, now, what have we got here? An anomaly, an anomaly, debris, and the listening post here. All right, let's get that anomaly out of the way first. Now, I don't really feel the need to do these anomalies because we've got everything we can get from them, I think, apart from potential missions. So I think it is still worth checking them out, considering we've not got much more to explore, really. Okay, come on. Eh, crash the Mako, please. What? I mean, don't crash the Mako, please. What the hell am I talking about? I'm forgetting how to English. That's a bright sun. A nice lens flare there. Very professional. 
Oh, there's, oh, there's minerals as well. That's actually kind of good. Because if I can get all the minerals, I'll happily do it. I'm just not going to go too much out of my way to do it. Yeah, I'm not going to get up here this way. Oh no, this way perhaps. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Yes. The hell is this? Well, first of all, I'm going to get these minerals. Assuming they're not off the edge. Which is very possible. No, oh, no, they're down here. That's okay. Uranium. Let's just walk up to this uranium and touch it, eh? Because why not? Not like anything's ever happened to anyone by doing that. Has it? Oh, wait. It has. Alright, now let's get to this thing, whatever it is. Looks to be a lot to explore here. At least two buildings. Whoa. Discovery. It appears these particle bores were shut down after breaking through into tunnels just below the surface. The shacks and equipment are stenciled with the logo of the Tenkara Mining Consortium, but there is no trace of the mining crew. Oh, the arachnid things. I can hear them. Cover me. Ooh, like that, okay. <laughs> yeah, I can hear the arachnid coming in there. I can hear them. Oh dear, this is not good. I guess the Rachni came from here then. Another medi kit. Well, medi gel, I should say. Oh, bombs, I didn't mean to fall in there. Area Enemy sighted Rex, what did you say? Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything here. Oh, there's a vehicle over there. Now, Mako, don't get jealous, but I want to check it out. You're a big girl. I'm sure you can manage it. What is this thing? Is there anything here? And the answer is no. Of course it is. All right, let's get back in the Mako. And get going to... This anomaly over here. Now, I do want to check the... Yep, I've got all the data disks as well. <gasps> That's good. I'm so far off the minerals, so I'm definitely not going to try to get those... Oh, dicks. I'm definitely not going to try to get those all done, because that'll just take forever. And I don't think we'll get anything from it. Really. So there's no point. I will take the high ground wherever possible. See, I made the fall more gentle there. I'm a good driver. I'm an excellent Mako driver technician guy. Well, maybe not, but uh, shut up. I'm guessing it's going to be on top of that, isn't it? What the... Oh, that's just... Lava or magma. Or, I keep forgetting which is which. Lava or magma. I really... I keep forgetting. It's definitely not on top of that. Yeah, this is actually a rather nice looking planet. I wouldn't want to live here. It looks a bit warm, but... Yeah, it, it looks appealing. It's visually appealing to me. I'm pretty sure I've got to go over there. It's at least on top or past it, so this is going to be the easiest route. And... That was my throat again. My throat keeps doing that. I really don't know why. There is nothing there. And... I don't think it's going to be on top of this thing. Why do we always break out into song when I'm surprised? Buried safe box. I bet there's a Prothean data disk in this. I bet. That's what I'm betting. Ah, League of One medallion. Well, that's that, that's a, that's good enough. We've already found all of them, but that's acceptable. All right, to this debris, and then to the listening post. Brum brum. Brum brum. 
I thought that was the tip of a pyramid there. It is not. Not that that would mean anything, because I've already got all the Prothean data disks that I need. Liari, you can look over these if you like. I'm sure you would love to. After all, you are a gigantic Prothean nerd and there's a thing over there. Which I don't believe is what we're going to. The hell? Oh, it's marked on... There's something marked on the map, though. Minerals, it looks like. In fact, didn't they say it was a mineral-heavy world or a resource-heavy world or something? It kind of adds up with what we're experiencing. No, don't, 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 don't. Oh, come on. You can do it. Mother f... Okay, that way it looks as if it's going to be good. Come on. I am getting used to my mouse now. Eventually. I've only had a few days, but I am slowly getting used to it. I got a new mouse, you see. To replace my previous one, which developed a left-click problem because I've been clicking too much with it. Oh, don't, don't, no, no! Oh, son of a monkey mother of... <laughs> uh -huh. I dislike the Mako! I'm sorry, Mako, but I do. I do not like you. Oh, son of a monkey! <sighs> now, it's partially my stupidity for trying to climb up something to- Oh, come on, you can do this! Good. Okay, there's the debris there. And there's something else down there which you're gonna have to check out. Crashed probe. This will probably contain a chewing insignia, I believe. Oh no, it contained goodies. That's even better, because we need goodies still, kind of, maybe, possibly. Yes, a very bright sun and a nice lens flare. Yeah, let's get down here. There's something here. Something not marked on the map. And, of course, resources. Which I believe is up here. Which I believe are up here, I should say. There it is, right there. Titanium! Me likey titanium! And, of course, we're decrypting the titanium. This is what all mining is like. Just so you know. And now whatever the hell this thing is, because it's not even marked on the map when we get close. When you get close to things, they usually get marked on the map, but not this. I really don't get this. I don't know what it is. Oh, it's an exit. It's an exit. We're going to exit out of here, aren't we? That's the only explanation, because we can't get in that way. And it's definitely a working door, because there's a light there. So that means... We go to... The... Listening post. And I bet it's going to be an underground one, or something like that. And then we're going to exit through there. Probably. Probably. Yes, very realistic lens flare. It doesn't look like a blurred repeated texture at all. <laughs> it is very, it is kind of pretty though, in a fleeting look there. Looks kind of nice. Boom! I'm shooting things! Like a madman! Now this level actually reminds me of Unreal Tournament 2004. Are they turrets? They are turrets. And they are Rachni. Okay, guys. Guns are the ready. We are the people there. There are people here.
Yeah, there are actually people here. This is good. What? We've got waves. Oh, son of a... Well, luckily for you guys, you've got the best there is. The ROI using a sniper rifle? Yeah, Rex, you're doing good, and all the although yeah, switch to your assault rifle too. Perimeter clear. I wish you were a tank brigade. No offense. <laughs> oh, you don't need tanks with me here. Hello, Lieutenant Durand. First Lieutenant Durand, sir. Third Brigade, 14th Infantry Regiment, and I am damn glad to see you. Duran Duran. <laughs> <sighs> we heard you needed some backup. Actually, we need to get the hell out of here. But I guess your ship couldn't carry us all. They dropped us here a few months back. We get supplies every couple weeks. We didn't see anything local that was more dangerous than lichen. Yesterday, these animals started coming out of the ground. No idea where they're from. This is what's left out of 90 men. I'm the ranking officer. Well, I know what they are. We do have a ship in orbit. We could bombard them. Wouldn't do much good. They're moving around deep underground. The only time they come near the surface, and they're right on our position. You bombard them. You take us out, too. Yeah, well, that's not very good. Now, why are you here? Why are you out here in the first place? There's been a lot of pirate activity in this cluster. We set up a chain of listening posts in the local systems, in case they have a staging base. Makes sense. They're called Rachni. You get a supply ship in recently? Yeah. But that was an Alliance ship, Commander. I mean, it was a drone. Running on automatics. But what- Will the Rachni come back? What we just fought was a probe. Our seismic sensors are picking up a crapload more on their way up from underground. We've got five minutes, tops. We might be able to hold them off if we were at peak, but you can see the fighting's busted this place up. Oh, we'll help. Do what you can to secure your position. We'll see if we can get some of your defenses operational. Aye, aye, Commander. You heard the man. Everybody pool magazines and grenades. Take a leak and a drink while you can. And if anyone wants a smoke, it's as good a time as any. You got any extra ammo, sir? You don't need ammo. You got thermal clips that just regenerate. <laughs> the generator has been ripped apart by Rachni claws, leaving the defensive turrets inoperative. It will be possible to power the turrets off the Mako's engine. But this would make it impossible to drive off either Mako's own weapons. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. I won't be using them anyway. All right. Where are they? I ain't slept in a long time. Hold the line! Oh dear, they're here. You must die. Take him down. Take him down. I would use my sniper rifle here, but it's gonna be worthless. Hold the line. It's gonna be effectively worthless anyway. Especially since it's just slow such slow slow firing. And these things are pretty weak anyway. So it's definitely not going to be the best weapon to use. And we can manage a few Rachni. I'll kill you. We don't seem to be getting experience from these either. Which is strange. Are we done? Not much time left, Commander. That wasn't even the full thing. Oh, crud. Is there anything more we can do? Yeah, there doesn't seem to be. Alright, you can still quick save. Don't shout and bless the Arachni. <laughs> Yeah, we've got to leave the Mako hooked up. I was just wondering if there was anything more we could do there. Is there anything we can find in here? I'm not going to grab that Medigel because we don't need it. I'm already full. Alright, guys. 
you get there. And you get... There. That should cover us both fairly well, and I'll move around. I'll check out these things here first. Wow, there's a lot of medigel here. High explosive rounds might be useful here, actually. You know, I'm going to try them out on my pistol. Uh, let's see. High explosive rounds nine. Not as much increased damage, but I think it might be better. I'll kill you. Holy crap, two shots is an overheat. That's no good. Oh, that is absolutely no good, that. That is complete cack. I might try Sledgehammer. I'm gonna try Sledgehammer. Increased physics force, or whatever that is. Hold the line. No, no, the damage decrease is very noticeable on that. I need these Shredder rounds. Unfortunately. Cryo rounds. Ah, that might be good. That's actually kind of good, but they don't have shields, so no. Alright, shred arounds. Yeah, we're holding these guys off pretty okay. It hardly seems worth using marksmen, really. Ah, these things just keep coming. Enemy is everywhere. Whoa! Taken down. I'll kill you. I do like how quickly marksman recharges mind. It is getting a lot it is a lot better than it was to begin with. They're taking them down so quickly. Enemy is everywhere. I've been poisoned. I'll kill you. Take it down. Take it down. This is rather easy, I've got to admit. We're not taking many hits. Whoa, holy crud. Holy crud. Yes. You must die. Don't say that to Rex. Holy hell, sir. Talk about a near run thing. You alright? Perfectly fine. Never mind me. Are you alright? Still on my feet. But we've been fighting for almost 26 hours. Whoa. None of us will be standing for long. Ma'am, we're getting a signal from one of the ground scan UAVs. A big hollow space about 500 meters under the surface. Right, that must be it. That must be where they're coming from. My people aren't in any condition for a clearing operation, though. No, oh, we'll take care of that. Just point us in the right direction. You don't have to do that, Commander. We've bled them. We can probably hold until a bigger ship arrives to get us off world. If you want to take a throw at it, we'll give you the coordinates. But it's your call. You saved our asses, Commander. Thanks. Hey, don't worry about it. Depot Sigma 23. What? Oh, I guess that's where the thing came from. Alright, we're going to destroy the Rachni base. Very nice. Now, do we have to de unhook the Mako from this? I'm hoping it might be automatic. We did have to! It would have been annoying to have walked all the way over there and then had to come back to unhook the thing. Or maybe we could have unhooked it from here manually. That's a possibility. Uh, but either way, we are making progress. And we're going to destroy the Rachni base, of course. Because if it is the queen that's doing this, well then she's going to she's gotta pay. Mining camp... Very safe box. And the Rachna infested mine. That's where we gotta go. I knew I had to go there at some point. I knew we would have had to. And why is... 
Um, Rex, are you okay? Um, Rex appears to be sticking his head out of the Mako. Well, whatever suits him, maybe it's a Krogan thing. Boom! I don't know why I did that. Boom! I wish you could speed the Mako up. Like some kind of turbo key or something. But alas, you cannot. You cannot. Now I do want to get this mine cleared out, and then we've got to figure out where the hell... Where the hell the things come from? I mean, like the original, the depot or something. Or the depot or depot. I don't know what pronunciation is correct. Whoa, whoa. Rum. And now we can go in here, no doubt. I'm on my way. Out of the Mako. Let's get in there. Kind of good job we discovered this place beforehand so we knew it was here. And that's probably why it wasn't marked on the map. Yeah, we can enter now. Quick save. And let's get in there. Oh, son of a monkey of... Okay, next video. I will get in there. Bye for now.